Yep. Nice. Make sure you're pedaling hard when the clock hits zero. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Good luck. Here we go. Man, I hate these starts. Hey, are you recording this, Matthew? I am. I'm going to do my best to kind of switch around so everybody can get a little bit of coverage, but I am recording it. Holy crap, who's that guy? I just want to modulate my language. Well, that'll be up to you because I'm only going to I – mean, I think only y'all will watch this one. <laughs> but there are some kids apparently out there, so just keep that in mind. I already dropped the burrito. No burrito. Smoke the clock. I know, Caroline. I'm way back here. I knew this for three seconds. Nice. Ah. Holy shit. <laughs> I just went from 20th to 40th in a split second. You had the S's? Yep. This is fun. Well, I know uh, Ben and Caroline are off the back already. Yep. All right. Here's up, Ben. We're together. All right, here comes the sprint. If you got any power, you better ramp it up now. Like Paul put in a pretty good time. I can't fall.
Second place. Yeah, Paul was second through that sprint. Hey, 48. Good job, Paul. Looks like Josiah got third. Yeah, good. Fuck. Great job, guys. All right, try and try and uh, hang in there a little while longer. Hey, Carolyn, you a group up with me. Just uh, four seconds ahead of you. We were riding together back to the group. My teammates right behind me. He's in front of me now. He is Ben. Well, looks like looks like Paul is off the back now. I'm in a small group. Hey, Carolyn, there are four kilometers in. Christopher, dig deep. Hang in there. Get him down. Yes, sir. If you can get over the, if you can get over the top of this group, you'll stay in with them. Uh, <laughs> All right, hang in there, Christopher. Keep going. Keep pushing. It's the wall. Okay. Just uh, hang in there. Try and push. Push up over the top here, Christopher. I gotta get heart rate. Well, if you hang in close, I think there'll be a little uh, regrouping here at the top. Yeah. Get up there. Good job. Good job. I can't hear you, love. 
Well, it looks like Josiah is going to be soft pedaling here for a while. Yeah. I definitely blew myself up on this track. What's wrong? My heart rate is way too high. I don't know if, if you guys can do it, Ben, but that little group that's a little bit up the road, if you join with them, uh, the next uh, 40 minutes or so will be a lot easier. Yeah, I'm trying. And Paul, it looks like you're kind of in a no man's land, so you're going to be lonely here for a little while. Yep. Well, just gonna ride this. There we go. <laughs> And Chris, if you guys can uh, work together, you'll uh, pull that group in front of you back in. That's a big group in front of us. That's like 20 plus riders. <laughs> I don't think so. I th yeah. Oh, that another group? Is that a third? Yeah. I'm in the third pack? Well, yeah. there's a bunch of single individual riders ahead of you, but uh, I, I think you got, you're going to be pulling in these little groups. I, I think you'll be able to get back towards the front. I don't want to be in the front. No, you don't, but uh oh, they're, they're saying we work together here now. I think there's now only uh, four or five riders ahead of you out there. I'm in 30th. Fire rate's down, though. So that's good. Okay, I'm going to conserve energy and try and compete for the second sprint. You got it, Paul. Yeah, same as me. I might even see it with my arrow bike. Good to see. I'm going to stay in this pack. 
only about 10 in front of us. Yeah, I was going to say, I, I think uh, in, in – if you guys work together, you can actually pull them back in, but it's going to. So it's like a single rider. We're about to small up. But Chris, for. Yeah, I, I would sit in, the, <laughs> sit in the middle of the pack as much as possible because you're going to need the rest for that uh, next climb. Yeah. I'm in nineteenth with everybody else. Give me that five three. Yeah, everybody else is fortieth or fortieth uh, or or lower. Not looking for it's, my teammate. Then. Yeah, it's really strung out now. Yeah, actually, just went ahead and swapped some of the sprinting like just knowing that I was going to compete in any of this. I can't really hear you, Paul. I think that was Josiah. Hi, John. I, I think Josiah switched out his bike. Yeah, I switched to my sprinting bike. I'm just going to stop the pedal till the next sprint and go really, really go for it. Sounds fair. What position are you in, Josiah? Uh, 69. <laughs> 69. <laughs> are you, uh, what do you have for a uh, power up? I've got uh, an arrow. Okay. Save it for the sprint. Yeah, I'm going to save it for the sprint. <clears throat> Caroline, how are you doing? I'm doing. Where are you? She's in 62nd. Uh, she's kind of riding by herself right now. Nice job, Caroline. Yeah, way to go, Caroline. It doesn't matter. It's your first ride in a while. You can get it. Caroline, you might be best thinking about that second KON. <laughs> Just saving it all well, up and her heart rate getting up that hill. High. I don't know what her max is, but it's sitting around 170 beats per minute, so it's it's pretty high. What's your max, Caroline? I honestly, the highest it's ever been was 182. Yeah, just judging from her breathing, I think she's pretty close to it, actually. Yeah. Yeah. Slow down a little bit, and then go for the KOM. See if you can get back in a pack. That'll help none. Well, the nearest group. Oh, there's no about, idea. They're about 45 seconds back. Uh, they're they're pretty much soft pedaling now. Uh, so She's kind of stuck here where, out by herself. Where does the second KOM start? When you come back through downtown, you go yeah, back up we, over the bridge. There's a way to go. It's it's not any kind of thing. kilometers. <laughs> So you guys want me to kind of soft pedal and then just go as hard as I can when I get there? I would. Yeah. Uh, if, if, if you might, you might want to just soft pedal and let that group that's about forty seconds back catch you and just sit in with them and rest. All right. This was a longer tailwind, isn't it? Steeper and longer? Yes, it's the forward, so it's going to be uh, steep and short. The reverse is the steep and short. The, the forward is kind of the longer one. Yeah. The long one is 900 meters. And unfortunately, Ben, you're kind of in no man's land as well. Oh, so somebody else needs to use a feather. I wasn't paying attention. Nice. 
six seconds away. I dropped my burrito thinking I wouldn't need it. Well, it's up to you. It looks like you have a group of uh, three about 15 seconds back. You may just want to sit up and wait for them and, and work with them. Yeah. And Paul, I don't know why that group in front of you is popping such big numbers in the middle of nowhere here. No idea. They're they're pushing four or five watts per kilogram uh, for no reason. They're scared of me in the sprint. Yeah, I'm scared of you in the sprint. You're on my team. Well, it's awfully early to be worried about that. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna make it there first. I think I'm almost back in the lead group. <laughs> Yeah, I, I thought you guys, as big as you were, you were going to reel them back in. So, yeah, the league group's about to come back together. Yeah. I hope you've been resting up. Resting up like a time trial. wanted to catch up to this group. Pick up the pace. Well, just yeah, just be careful about uh, riders jumping from your group to that group and then dropping them right away. Yeah. I'm close to the front, so. Good point. Because, yeah, it looks like a few riders have made the jump already, but yeah, it looks like you're coming back. Let me see if I can split them. No, just sit in and rest as much as possible. Yeah. Well, I dropped the burrito and see if I can drop that for the group. Nice. They're getting a little spiky, a little pointy going faster. Yeah, I was going to say, be careful hanging off the back too much. Yeah. Looks like some guys are jumping off the front a little bit. Yeah. I still wouldn't worry too much about the sprint. Just don't get dropped. Yeah. All right, keep pushing, Christopher. Keep pushing. Yeah. Dig deep, dig deep. Paul, try and hang with these guys and let them lead you out. Yeah. Oh. 
All right, it's going to take you 23 seconds uh, to get in the top 10, I think. Here. All right, Paul, dig deep. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Paul, get it. Push, 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 push. Damn, 11 watts per kilogram. Don't die, don't die. If you do get through this front first. Push, push, push. Keep it up, keep it up. Just a few more seconds. Come on, you can do it. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh, no, I close. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, that looked like it hurt. <laughs> well, unfortunately, when when you're in a, such a small group, there's not much chance of uh, getting into the top ten. You're at such a big disadvantage. And the group split again. Do not hang with them. That was a good effort, Ben. Uh, <laughs> hey. For my effort after the sprint. All right, just I uh, put up some big numbers here in the sprint. All right, I'll try. I'm expecting to see 1,100 watts. <laughs> I should be able to get 13. <laughs> <laughs> All right, push, Josiah, push, push, push. Oh, I didn't know it's here. <laughs> I'm not sure I've ever seen 1550 <laughs> as far as watts are concerned. <laughs> he just said 1557. Holy shit. Nice. nice. Nice work. I can't do that in a car. He just he got fifth. Good job, Josiah. Nice work. Nice work. Ready to get the point. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> yeah, now I remember why I had you always doing the pulls up the front, uh, up in the front. Yeah. 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 All right, Chris, Fred, down to you. Well, the front groups have split. He's he's in a group of four. I don't think you're going to be pulling back that big group in front of you. Yeah, they blew up me. Me up. Yeah, now here's the climb. This is going to be a grinder. Yeah. 
Just settle in and uh, maintain your pace. Damn, 2.17. Yeah, I think we're going to see some upgrades after tonight. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Christopher, once you go through the banner, see if you can link up with that guy in front of you. Because if, uh, yeah, if, if you can, it's going to be uh, tough to the finish. He's slowing down. That's what he's made for me. And if you two can work together, you might pull up that, uh, pull back that guy that's about 20 seconds ahead of you. Oh, man, I thought I would have got a PR on that. I must have had a big pack. Paul, you got to run down vents ahead of you just for, uh, for bragging's sake. Yeah, for pride's sake here. Is that DeCosmo? Yes. He's about four seconds ahead of uh, Paul. I'm gonna fuck his shit up. Hey, Give me an elbow when you ride by. Give him a shove. Hey, no hooliganism. I know anything about bins. He will give it 110%. Not to be caught by me. And Ben, if you uh, if you have anything left, you're not that far behind Paul. You guys could link up here. Yeah, I just hit the start of the comm. Yeah, he's about seven seconds ahead of you. Here, I'm going to use a super tough and wait. Uh, 
All right, Paul and Ben, when you guys uh, get to the top of this climb, work together to pull Vince back in. Maybe you guys can group up with him. Nice work, Ben. Thanks. Thanks for Ben, Paul. Yeah, I think you're going to be by yourself to the finish because it doesn't look like uh, anybody's going to catch you from behind. And uh... Miller was just sitting on my wheel. I slowed down. He slowed down. <laughs> yeah, he's blown up. What position, Chris? I'm in 29. He's in 20. Yeah, he's he's. He's 18 seconds back, and then uh, the next big group is a minute up the road. That's a long ways to go. It's six point ten kilometers. Can't fucking see straight. There's a setting that you can turn off for that. Just shut my eyes. Yeah. Oh. That worked. Listen to your heart pound. Is there a super tank coming? Coming off the bridge. Right at the end of the bridge. Yeah, we're, we're, it's going to be a couple mi minutes up the road here. Paul, if you can catch me on, looks like Ben and Vince are uh, holding up for you. Nice. Just tell Vince to slow down. I reeled him in, and he uh, he's sitting on my wheel now. Yeah, it looks like you guys. Uh, it's kind of like Vince do that. Just hold him there, Ben. I'm coming. I am just stop pedaling. Two watts a kilo. Uh, that's a good pedal for me. Uh, I don't know about that. I'm shocked at how I got dropped into that first sprint. How did Caroline join the climb? Still there, Caroline? I think she's still on the climb. She's going pretty hard. Yeah, she's just about to finish. Caroline, don't on mute. Just go. Don't on mute. Just go. Yep, she just crossed the, crossed the banner. Nice okay, job, nice. Caroline. I think she's in a lot of pain, judging from her silence and her heart rate. Yeah, she's on mute. I can get her stream. Well, her heart rate was close to 180 there. Woo! That is fast. Nice job, Caroline. Way to dig deep. Take one for the team. So what do you think, Matt? Next time we train stay together more as a team? No. Hammer here. In, in, these, in, these races, in these races, it's just each each rider is gonna have something they're good at. It's gonna be hard to, to work together as a team. Yeah. I'm fairly good at riding by myself. No friends. Well, the good news about these qualifying races is once we get put in our uh, category, 
they'll be a little bit uh, more competitive. I thought we were yeah. already in a C1. Well, well, no, this is the second qualifying race. Okay. They're supposed to recategorize everybody based on how they do these first couple of races. Oh, okay. Josiah is just glad that there's not a time cut off on this. <laughs> hey, he did his work in the sprint. Yeah. He put in his 1,500 watts. God, I've never even seen that. Where do you go, Josiah? Yeah. It's working. Just, just glad to add some points to the team because I'm definitely not getting any on placement. <laughs> Okay, Ben, we're going to put a, a dince in a grind sandwich here. Let's make him do some work. Nice job. You, ever, you guys ever see the Schleck sandwich with Andy and Frank Schleck like 10 uh -huh. years ago? Those guys are awesome. Twin brothers that were partnering up to bang somebody in a race. I missed that. Andy technically won the tour because uh, Panthador was kicked off for cheating. But Frank was never as good as Andy. They own a bike shop in Belgium now. All right, Paul, That's come true. on. Hang on. Don't let him drop you. Come on, Paul. I'm working. Last year, there was a, a Wednesday, 1 o'clock my time ride, hosted by... Andy and Frank from their shop in Belgium where they're chatting with riders. Pretty cool. Sounds cool. Ah, well, Paul. Oh. <sighs> 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 All right, good job, guys. It's a charging. Well, I know you guys can out-sprint him. Yeah, that's my goal. Bait him onto the finish and lay the hammer down. Come on, Paul. Come there, come on. Get it, Paul. I Ten minutes. Trying to make him. Trying to make him work. Well, I think you might be out of luck on that. <sighs> Can you see his heart rate? I'll check it out. Let's make him pull well, off. He's always said he had a, a low heart rate, but I think there's something wrong with his monitor. He's sitting at 125 beats per minute. Bullshit. Bullshit. No That's because he's riding an e-bike. <laughs> well, I'm not sure what monitor he uses, but I've never believed it. He's putting out 250 watts at 125 beats per minute. I, that's uh, no. That's, he's working hard. A TTT with Vince on a Thursday. He's working. Chris, I'm afraid there's not going to be much coverage of you in the last few miles because you're pretty boring. You're sitting by yourself. Yeah, no, I'm uh, doing a lot of work. I got a couple of minutes to do go. I'm more, I'm, late, I'm more interested in seeing how Ben and Paul and Vince uh, get along here. We're going to do him over. We're going to kick him up his bike and nick his wheels in the tunnel. 
I shut them off the grid. Yeah, sorry, I'm not more exciting. This wasn't my finest race. I thought I would do a little better on the KOMs, I just got smoked. <laughs> Hopefully your heart rate's come down. Yeah, she's hanging in there. Dude, that guy's catching up to me. Yeah, you don't have much further to go. Keep pushing, Christopher. Thanks. Guy reeled off like 15 seconds all of a sudden on me. Right, everybody. This was fun. Yeah, was good Chris. Wow, Caroline. Let's do it next week. Absolutely. You finished, Christopher? Yeah, Christopher just finished. Twenty-nine. Nice. How are you doing, Paul? Ben, don't do too much work for these guys. Be careful here. Don't let them push over the top and uh, gap you. Good oh. job, everybody. All right, Ben, if you're feeling strong, I think you could uh... – no, never mind.
Well, let's turn up the pace here. Yep. Man, that earth for 360 watts. Yeah. Ben's Ben's heart rate is 185. Oh my gosh! How old are you, Ben? 46. Oh my gosh! Man. All right, see if you can catch that guy in front of you. Push, 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 Ben. Come on. Come on, Paul. Let me with you, Ben. You guys have gap Ben's. Great. How about the Charlie guy behind us? Yeah, keep pushing, keep pushing. What's up, guys? All right, Ben, keep the pace up, keep the pace up. Yeah, Paul. You guys can do it. Keep going, Ben, keep going. He's catching you. Push, Ben, push, push, push. Damn, man, he's wearing the same jersey. Good job, guys. Good job. You guys done? Yeah. Uh, uh. Everybody. Who's still on the course? Caroline, Josiah? Yeah, Caroline is uh, coming up. Uh, she's making a little climb uh, in the underwater bridge. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm sweeping the course for any struggles. And uh, Josiah's about five minutes back, so he's going to be another seven or eight minutes to finish. <sighs> nice work, everybody. Yeah, great job, everyone. Keep pushing, Holy Caroline. Shit. Don't let those uh, that group that's 11 seconds back catch you. Keep pushing. No. Yeah, right in the last uh, 300 meters, my quads were locked up. All I could do is sit and pull my hamstrings. <laughs> well, your heart rate was pretty damn high. Yeah, my uh, my calves are cramping up towards the end. Holy shit! I broke a sweat doing that. I think I broke a lot more than a sweat. I feel like my entire body's leaking. On good sweat, not on other fluid. Come on, Josiah. Take hey, care of right, Caroline. Yeah. She's, she's still uh, a little ways out from the finish. She's got a group of three about 10 seconds back. Go on, Caroline. Don't let them catch you. You got it, Caroline. Good job, Caroline. Don't start, Caroline. Hammer down. Way to go. There's the banner. Good job. Oh my god, I just saw the word sprint again on the screen. I nearly threw up.
Josiah, you know there's only one rider behind you on the course. You know who that is? You. <laughs> that would be me. That's what I'm doing. I'm just sweeping the course for everybody. Bring it home, Josiah. Well, like I said, I guess they don't have a broom wagon, so you're okay. <sighs> I wish these races were like at four in the afternoon. Yeah, that's always the problem I have. I'm in Houston, and when uh, when I actually can ride, by the time my heart rate calms down and I actually get to sleep, usually it's like one or two in the morning. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna have a couple glasses of wine after it. It helps to calm me down, but it's more like uh, my peak strength performance, whether it's lifting, lifting, whatever. Is around three to four in the afternoon. In the nighttime, my power is lower, my heart rate's higher, very consistently. Well, unfortunately, I think real world and real life gets in the way of all of our performance. <laughs> that, that is true. <sighs> Damn four o'clock Zoom calls and uh, <sighs> meetings. So, Caroline, are you still alive out there? Sorry, were you guys talking to me? Yeah, just to see how you're feeling. That looked pretty painful. Uh, I'm shaky. Like I said, I hadn't been in for a while, though, so. Let me finish strong. Yeah, good work. There's always next week. Yeah. Hopefully. What Do we know what next week's course is? Uh, the schedule yeah. is out for the whole season. I forget what it is, but uh, you can go on. well, it's also on the WTRL side. Okay. But they're all going to be kind of like this with some sprinting and some climbing. Yeah. When do they? Uh, this is the, they have two qualifiers, right? And then we're done with qualification. Yeah, this is the second qualifying race, and next week is supposed to be the start of the regular season. So next week is McCurry Flatland Loop. So, so next week is the McCurry. start of the regular season. This was just a qualifying race? Yeah, they're going to resort the teams according to the, the results. And, uh... Okay. We got it so, next week, too. So theoretically, we'll be with the kind of a group that's close to our abilities, which makes it a lot more okay. fun. Right. All right, I got to go, guys. I really appreciate everything. It was a lot of fun. Talk yeah, good job. Good, good nice effort. I'll, I'll post my recording here in a few minutes as soon as Josiah finishes. Nice. Um, and then uh, when would the points should be up either later tonight or tomorrow morning, right? Well, I don't know. Uh, you may want to be a little bit patient with them. Though. <laughs> Depends on how many people complain. Usually when Just, the regular season starts, they're pretty good about having them the next day, but uh, it's still early, so it may be a little while. Josiah hey guys, hit that one sprint pretty hard because he passed me for a second, and then all of a sudden he like was gone behind me. So I'm back, I'm back at the first sprint. Josiah was fifth. I got third. I, this yeah. is on the, on the the fastest through segment, so we were and he, three and he, three and five, and then Josiah was what five on the way back as well. Yeah, he was five in the second sprint as well, and he just finished. Good job, Josiah. Hey, thanks, guys. Nice. Oh.
Pretty amazing, guys.